the students have expressed to me uh, ever since we decided to come back and, and teach in person, just how, how important it was, not only to be able to make music live and with others, but to also be able to give it and play it for others. It feeds everybody. It's a, it's, it's a very deep and necessary nourishment. Students and faculty took to the stage in Carruth Auditorium Friday night for the second installment of the Chamber Music Masterworks concert series. There's a limited number of spaces on Carruth stage, the Carruth Auditorium stage, and so in order to maintain distancing, they've had to cut numbers. They've also to change repertoire to suit those numbers. Chamber music was tailor-made to this situation. Last fall, over 20 concerts were held here, but this year, that number is nearly half that. And the audience has gone from in-house to online. The system that we've installed is completely independent of the internet. It's been set up throughout the building, and it turns our halls into real recording studios. In addition to performing virtually, students and faculty playing brass and woodwind instruments have had to take precautions due to the pandemic. There are big plexiglass shields between every player. They are very much separated. I think as long as we're all careful on stage and careful at rehearsals and that kind of thing, we'll, we'll, we'll be okay. While it would be wonderful to physically attend a concert, for now we will have to settle for live music via live stream. For SMU-TV, I'm Brooklyn Hahn.